For many, hearing their age group is eligible for a COVID-19 vaccine brings a sense of relief and excitement. 46-year-old Aaron Klassen is one of those people. The Regina residents' age group received the go-ahead to get their shots about two weeks ago. When I was notified, which I heard on the news, um, I had about a four-hour four hour window to get down to the drive through clinic. Um, and unfortunately, the, the lineup was already too long, and that was it. The city ran out. Vaccine supply has been scarce since. On Tuesday, 42-year-olds were approved to book appointments starting today. And on Friday, it will open up to 40-year-olds as well. But Klassen says she still can't book an appointment. She's worried her age group will have to compete with those that are newly added. I'm more than happy to wait my turn. I just feel like they're, um, this race to include um, or to keep advancing quickly may be creating a gap. And if there's a big gap of um, portion of the population that got washed over, that's just not effective, effective vaccination strategy. <laughs> the province previously said all Saskatchewan residents who want a shot could have their first jab by mid-May. But now the province is saying everyone will be eligible by then instead. Well, there's a big difference, of course, between simply being eligible by mid-May and actually getting having everybody who wants the first shot to get it by, by mid-May. You're sort of uh, punting, you know, any accountability for uh, for not hitting that target because you said they're eligible, but there may not be the capacity to, to meet that need by mid-May. In a statement to CBC News, the province said when age eligibility opens up to a younger group, appointments fill up fast, especially in urban centres like Regina and Saskatoon. The province encourages people to consider travelling to other towns and cities for immunizations. Meanwhile, many seniors are still waiting for their second dose. We were essentially promised that we would get our second shot within four months. So I think within the four months, I mean, people shouldn't be too anxious. There is a, a reasonable level of immunity. But, but if you start missing the four-month target, then, you know, immunity levels will probably drop off. According to the province, that round of second doses will begin as supply allows. And more vaccines are expected to arrive in Saskatchewan soon. Laura Sharpletti, CBC News, Regina.